Welcome to the Friday Special Home of the Day, Episode 2. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. And if this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the little bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. All right, now in this Friday special, we're looking at straight razor bevel setting, the basics. All right, let's get to it. For setting the bevel, we are going to be using the 1000 side of this stone, okay, right here. And I'm going to put it in this holder. Now the stone has been soaking, so it is wet. Now, I'm going to put that in there. There we go. I'm going to go ahead and just put a bit more water on that. Okay, got to keep those stones nice and wet. All right, now, here we go. We're going to set the bevel on this, and uh, this razor so far has been brilliant, so I don't expect this is going to be too hard. So here we go. We're going to do 30. Nah, let's do 40. Let's, well, let me see. Let me see. It'll either be 30 or 40. All right, here we go. There's 40. Feels good. There's 40. Now we're flipping it over. We're going to do 20 this time. And 20 on this side. All right. And now, uh, this is probably another good time for me to give a shout out to the stallion. Uh, this is where I learned how to hone in this manner, is from him. All right. And uh, it's super simple, and it doesn't take a rocket scientist, guys. Anybody can do this. All right. Now, let's get that stone wet again. Let's finish this up. And I think we'll just about have a bevel set. Okay. Let's do it. Ten. Ten, five, five. Now ten X strokes. All right, that ought to be about 10, if it's not right at 10. Now, let's do the thumbnail test and see if we got a bevel, okay? Now, it's a weighted blade only. Oh, yeah, dig it in the whole way. 
Very nice. All right. Now I'm going to cut away and we'll put it under the microscope and you can see what it looks like on the bevel now. All right. Okay, so now we've got a bevel set. Let's see what it looks like. Now what we're looking for is to have that bevel even from the very heel to the toe all the way down. And there's that bad spot, but we've got it worked out. And okay, so now here the toe is got a skinnier bevel. than the heel. Well, not much, I guess, right? Yeah, maybe a little bit. All right. And now this side. Okay. The bevel looks really even all the way down so far. Yeah. Well, a little thicker on the back end, on, on the heel. But that's all right. Okay, so now we're going to, we got the bevel set, but I want an even bevel from the heel to the toe. So we're going to work on the toe. Seems like the toe on both sides needs a little work. Alright, so let's go ahead and we're just going to apply a little more pressure on the toe and we'll do it. pressure on the toe. There's 40. Now 20. Let me just Take a quick look, just with my eyes. Yeah, looking pretty good. All right, let's just keep going. And ten. Now five. And five. Okay. Now, what do we got? Oh yeah, I think that's looking better. All right. Just get that stone wet again. And now 10 X strokes.
All right, that should be 10 or thereabouts. Okay, let's go ahead and put this under the scope again. We'll give you guys another look. Be right back with you. All right, let's look at that bevel now. All right, now see that is a really nice even bevel. There we go. Pretty much all the way to the end. Yeah, very nice. Okay, now the other side. Okay, bevel looks pretty good. Pretty darn good. Now, I also have another question here from uh, Prosecute1966, and he asked uh, if I would uh, explain the idea of pushing the blade versus moving the blade back and forth in this video. So, I will go ahead and do that. Now, what we are going to use is the 3000 stone, all right? That's what we're using right now to finish setting the bevel and uh, really getting this uh, razor all sorted out, okay, and getting it shave ready, all right? Now, the stone has been soaking in uh, for at least five minutes or so, actually probably more than that, so that's good. So here we go. We're going to start and we're going to do 40 laps. Okay, there's 40. Now 40 laps on this side. All right, there's 40. Now, here's what's going on. As we're doing this, that uh, going doing laps like that back and forth, uh, that is actually taking and as you go like this, it's cleaning up the edge. As you go like this, it's actually going to curl the edge back up this way. So when you turn it over, when you go like this, it's curling the edge up this way. And when you're pulling it back towards you, it will go ahead and clean up that edge. Now, that's why when we do our 10 X strokes, we always got the edge of the blade leading in the spine trailing, all right? So here we go. Now that was uh, 40, right? I don't know, I lost track. So let's do 20, all right? <laughs> There's 20. Twenty. Now ten. And ten. Okay. Now. We're going to do 10 X strokes, okay? And now that is like this. And I swing the toe around. There's one. Two. Three. Four. Five, 
six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. There we go. All right, I'll go ahead and cut away now, and we'll look at this uh, edge under the microscope again. All right, this is on the front side, and you can see that nice bevel really formed, and it is solid, and it's fairly uniform across the entire edge. Now, this is the back side, and it is looking beautiful too. All right, there we go. Hopefully you found that helpful. Click right over here to see Honing Basics. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.